Time now is 6.43. I hope your Monday is off to a good start. If not, at least you'll have a good hair day today. A perfect five, a nice day. It's going to be cold outside, though. Highs only in the upper 40s. But that is a little warmer than yesterday, so we are headed in the right direction. Not in the short term, though. We're in the 20s all across the area, and there's a lot of frost this morning, so be ready for that. Our storm trackers are reporting 27 this morning in Burgess. Dave Hicklin reporting uh, 28 there in Florence. A lot of frost on the ground and frosty across North Carolina, too. Tom Myers reports 27 in Sunset Beach. Cliff Cole, the same thing in Lakeview. Our forecast today, definitely a cold start. It will take until about 9 o'clock to get to the freezing mark. By noon today, we'll be up to around 40 or 41 degrees. And then for the afternoon, the high today, about 47, 48 degrees. And that is a few degrees warmer than yesterday. Plus, we're going to have a lot more sunshine. So hopefully it will feel a little better out there if you are not a fan of the cold weather. Clear skies on our satellite picture, and that won't change a whole lot for about eh, 12 to 18 hours. As far as rain is concerned or anything else that might come out of the clouds, that isn't going to happen until about Friday. This will be our next storm system. Doesn't look like a major storm system for us here in the Carolinas, but at least a chance of rain. It looks like on Christmas Eve, maybe even on Christmas Day as well. Now ahead of that storm system, temperatures will be warming up. High temperatures today in Mississippi, Alabama into the 50s, even 70s out there in Texas today. Now we're not going to get nearly that warm, but we'll be near 55, 56 degrees by about Wednesday headed into Thursday. And then a chance of rain returns, it looks like, on Friday. But we're still talking maybe a 30% chance of rain today. Now, the warm-up will be a slow process. As I said, highs today mainly in the upper 40s. About 47 today in Myrtle Beach. About the same thing in Whiteville, North Carolina. And a lot of sunshine today in King Street. You'll probably get up to about 49, maybe 50 degrees. Here's that Christmas Day forecast. As we see it right now, though, it will be a little warmer, as we were just talking about. That storm system out to the west now will still be in the area. A cloudy day. I'm going to keep our rain chance about 30%, so definitely not a washout. If your kids are uh, getting a new bike or something like that, at some point we should get some dry weather to be able to uh, take the new bikes out for a test ride. The sun returns today. Uh, it's still pretty cold out there, and we'll stay dry for a few days. There is an eclipse tonight, a lunar eclipse, and that will happen about 2.41. So let's fast forward to about 2.30, 3 o'clock in the morning. Mainly clear skies, but there could be some high clouds out there around that time. Hopefully we'll see the uh, eclipse as it happens tonight. Tomorrow on the cloudy side, but it will be warmer. We'll finally get our highs tomorrow into the 50s. Mostly sunny today, staying chilly. The high today, mainly in the upper 40s. Into the mid-20s tonight. Bundle up if you're headed out to look at the eclipse. That peaks at 241. It lasts for about three hours, though, so I'll be sure to check that out sometime tonight. Mid-50s for high temperatures by Tuesday and Wednesday. Our warmest weather looks like probably on Wednesday for the Grand Strand. And there's your inland forecast. No rain until Christmas Eve. It's only a 20, uh, 20 to 30 percent chance. And we'll keep our highs in the mid-50s. Speaking of Christmas time, I have a Christmas color of the weather picture this morning. This one from Bianca Oxendine from Oxendine Elementary. I think what we see here <clears throat> is something we don't of often see. That's a snowman looking in the window. <laughs> but it, it, he can't come inside because then he'll melt. Absolutely. And he's checking out that beautiful Christmas tree. Look at that. That's a fantastic. Peeping Tom Snowman. I love it. <laughs> now that sounds kind of creepy, yeah, but yes. It does. <laughs> he's a happy snowman, though. I like that. That's, That's very creative. I don't see many sad snowmen unless they're, you know, unless they're about inside. This tall. Yeah, yes. right. Exactly. Well, that's a nice picture, Bianca. Thank you for that. And kids, we want to see your pictures, too, so send them on in to 101 McDonald Court in Myrtle Beach or P.O. Box 10052 in Florence. 